What's going on guys, Imaginary World here. Today I just wanted to bring you a video showing you how to make a yeet type beat. I'm giving away some samples and the project files. So if you like the beat I made, make sure you go in the description and download the samples in the project file. And while you're at it, go ahead and leave a like and subscribe. All right, let's go ahead and get into it. So before jumping into this, I did some sound design. Most of these were designed in Serum, but those are all gonna be included in the project file. I know they're all at once, but you can get an idea. So the first sample I'm gonna use is this synth main here. Uh, we're gonna use this for our chords, and I'm gonna be writing this in F minor. Luckily, the chord structure is gonna be pretty simple here. We're just gonna find our bass notes first. And we are working at 150 BPM, by the way. So these are our bass notes. And from here, I'm just gonna add one extra note on top. We're not gonna be doing full chords with this. This is more so intervals. So I'm liking how that's sounding for our chord structure. Let's go ahead and get another simpler pulled up here. I'm gonna pull this lead sample in on simpler. And by the way, all these samples are tuned to C, so you shouldn't have to do anything to use them, just drag them in. All right, so that's working for me for the lead. Let's go ahead and move on to the pluck. And for this one, I'm gonna set it to one shot. Now that we got that, I'm gonna go ahead and drop a clap sample in here so we can kind of get a rhythm going. Something I will say is for like a mixing tips, um, the drums seem to be sitting pretty low in these mixes. So I'm gonna keep my drums pretty low um, and we'll go ahead and pull up a hi-hat here. So for the hi-hats, I'm actually gonna just do these eighth notes on a 16 note grid so that I can put a sample in between like this. And then every other note, I'm gonna take out that middle note so it sounds like this. And then to spice it up a little bit, we'll add some rolls. So we're just gonna keep the hi-hats really simple there. Let's go ahead and pull in our 808. So what I did here is I took the spins 808 and I distorted it, but I cut out the attack so there's not really much of a kick sound because if you listen to any Yeet songs, you can kind of tell that there's like no attack, there's no punch to his 808s. So I just dialed up the attack and committed it to audio so you can use it as a sample. What I'm going to do here is I'm just going to take the MIDI from my chords, lay them out here, and now we can just delete these top notes and use the bass notes to make our 808. Now another thing you might hear a lot in Yeet songs is using a different bass sound other than 808. So I made this one right here in Serum. And we can drag that in and use that for some of the bass notes instead of the 808. 
take these first two notes and use those as the synth bass instead of the 808 and then delete them from our 808. Let's hear how that sounds. And then I just need to tweak this so that the notes aren't overlapping. We'll use this one on classic mode instead of one shot so I can cut off the sample before the 808. All right, and then I think pretty much the last thing I want to do here is just add those classic yeet bells. I got the bell loaded up here in one shot mode, so let's go ahead and draw these in. I think pretty much the last thing I want to do here is just clip the master. So I just got my glue compressor on here and I'm just going to turn it up the makeup gain until this sounds pretty good. After clipping the master, I went ahead and named everything, and I'm gonna go ahead and just do a quick layout here. For the verse, I'm gonna do a little bit more of a simple hi-hat pattern. I'm gonna cut out all those rolls. And then what I've done is I've switched it so that the chorus is gonna have just full on 808s and then the verses are gonna have that bass stab. So yeah, that's how you make a yeet type beat. They're not too complicated. Uh, the chord structure is pretty simple. The melodies are pretty simple, but they just hit really hard and they're a lot of fun to make. So make sure you go ahead and look in the description and click the link and download this project file as well as the samples I've created for you guys. It's all free. Um, you don't have to give me anything. Just download them and have fun with them. If you guys did enjoy the video and you like the type of content I make, go ahead and hit the like button and hit the subscribe button as well. And if you have any ideas for future content you want me to make, go ahead and leave those in the comments down below. I do read them and a lot of times if it's a good suggestion, I will make it. Other than that, thank you for making it to the end and I hope you have a great day.